Well, spiritual versus religiosity, the goal, you've got to keep focused on the goal. The Prabhupada was very clear. What is the goal of all this? To always remember Krishna and never forget Krishna. And by the way, in Eastern, Eastern Orthodox Christianity, that's the goal too. And that's pray without ceasing. That's the whole point is that, you know, when Prabhupada came to the West, he told us to chant 64 rounds, which was Bhakti Siddhanta's standard. And we couldn't do that. We couldn't do it. So he said, okay, so now you can chant 32 rounds. We couldn't do that either. So then he said, all right, do 16. And that's a minimum. That's a start. Just start. Do the best you can. And so um, we did the best we could, but it, it's not meant that we should just be satisfied with that. So these, these rules and regulations, particularly the four regulative principles, you, you can try to follow them separately from spiritual realization. You can do that. People do that and struggle with that. If you find your love, you're not going to be interested in, for example, exploiting your body and other people's bodies for sex life. Why? Because you have a higher taste. You're not going to be interested to eat animals because you understand they are Krishna's property. I love them. Out of love, we don't do that. Out of care. We also don't, what are the what other principles are? Alcohol, intoxication, because we have discovered self-love and love for others. If I drink and drive, I can kill people. You know, if I'm intoxicated, I can hurt people. So it's really born out of care. It's not about rule following, although people really get focused on the four regulative principles and that's the goal of it. The goal is we want to be awake. If you're intoxicated, you can't be awake. But you also can't, like yourself, people who are harming other people and other animals and harming themselves cannot actually experience true bhakti because it's about love and care. Does that make sense? Yeah. So, you know, we, we so want to find, that, find our love. What you're saying is that, yeah, I think that if you find your love, following the rules will become natural. And uh, if we don't, if we get caught in following the rules and struggling with that, we will not find the love and we will not come off as very loving to others also. Yeah. Right. So Prabhupada, Prabhupada said this many times. It's not neti neti. It's not, not this, not that, not that. It's positive devotional service. So his solution to everything is, is do some positive devotional service. Hearing, chanting, worshiping, find something that gives you joy and offer it, and all the other problems go away. You know, we spend a lot of time focusing on the problems. You know, we need to be focusing and engaging in the positive activities and solutions.